What's this? A video that's not an advent calendar? Oh my god, shock horror. Not beauty related to you. Not beauty related to. Hello everybody, we are back with Flaming Licks once again, another hot sauce video. As always, I am super excited to be doing another hot sauce video. I cannot wait. Are you excited? I am excited. I hope uh, nothing will make me cry today. It was like very spicy sauce at some point. I don't remember what like a month or two months ago. I didn't the remember. La yeah, so if you go on to like... our um, lifestyle playlist, I believe, you'll see that the other hot sauce videos mm. that we've done. The last one, there was some pretty spicy stuff now, I have mm. to say. It was, yeah. was pretty spicy. Yeah, so uh, we're going to crack on. Uh, but yeah, so today... What 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 should we start with? Um, I don't know. We have a one pack of snacks as usual, oh, yeah. and like three sauces. Yeah. So let's get with, let's try with a sauce first, and then we'll just go snack yeah. for snacks. Just choose one. Yeah. So usually there's two. There's um, usually three three items and a snack. Sometimes it's a chut one's like a chutney or a jam, and then usually there's two of them which are sauces. So mm. uh, yeah, let's start with a sauce. So I'm gonna unwrap it. Feels like Christmas for me. <laughs> Okay, so this is Scorpion Maruga Extra Hot Sauce, but okay. it's vegan, which is great for me. Um, so, yeah, and it's the brand Pat Pinkies. So, let me just have a look if they say anything. Pat Pinkies, Scorpion Maruga Hot Sauce. No need to say that the Scorpion Maruga chili brings a, a level of heat not suited for the faint hearted. Okay, uh, once over the initial roaring burn, uh, the sensational Guyanese. Guyanese flavor. Like anyway, yeah. <laughs> Come through superbly. Use wisely, and it will make any dish delicious. Use wisely, Michelle. You don't really want um, to burn your mouth. Okay, that's that's, that's for me. Okay, that that, that doesn't you. look like you use wisely. <laughs> I'm being wise. I'm using it wisely. Mm. Okay. We've actually got water today. There's been quite a few videos yeah, that prepared. we've done in the past where we didn't have water and we mm. were very very silly. It's spicy. Not the um, I want to cry spicy. But it's quite spicy. It's like um, uh, I'm like coming down with a, a bit of a mm. cold. I think I just like um, it just pretty much cleared everything. I can breathe again. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah there's a level of heat to that. Mm -hmm. mm. That's really nice flavor. Yeah, the good thing is about doing the hot sauce videos, mm. especially in this current climate. If you're feeling um, if you're feeling a bit down due to like a cold or a flu mm. or something like that, this will definitely kick. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. It's a bit of spice. I don't know how to describe the taste of that one though. Mm, like pe peppers? Can I... Peppery, a bit peppery, yeah, a bit but it's really nice. Mm. Okay, let's try snacks now. Okay. You will read a little so, bit about that because this is not a vegetarian yeah, it's snack. it's not a vegetarian snack, so... As you can see, there's a chicken on it. So this is Little Bobby Jeb presents the original chicken crackling. Yeah, chicken crackling ha habanero, an absolute member favourite from many boxes back. No words and you just crack a beer, pop this open and enjoy. Okay. okay, um, it doesn't really sound very convincing to me, uh, but um, I'm going to try it because I'm the only one who eats meat here. It looks like it's <laughs> it smells like a food, um, like, like, like dog food. Oh, so oh my god, it, so if you've ever been to a pet shop, it smells like pet shop food. I'm going I to show not. you, I'm going to show you. Yeah, it looks like like um, um, dog food a little bit here. I think when I opened the box, or like so... very old um, KFC. I think chicken. when I looked in the back, did it say, I swear I saw something when I opened it, it's about chicken skin. Yeah, chicken skin, which yeah. is like, uh, honestly, I'm the person who actually when I eat, when I eat chicken, or remove the skin. The... When you ate chicken, like, you know, ages ago, did you remove skin or did you eat no, the skin? No, I used to eat it with skin. I used to eat it okay. with skin, yeah. Um, I don't, but, you know, someone has to try it, so that'll be me. And apparently, it's delicious, so... Go on, then. It's not bad. Average. Um, I would say it's like a really good um, beer snack or that type of thing. It's very salty. It has a little bit like a chicken flavor to it, but um, is it that amazing? I wouldn't say so. And it smells like um dog food. So okay. um, yeah, but you know, with beer, I guess. Moving back to what we were doing before. Yeah. Okay, so next up is this is Auntie Sauces Chili Mango Alfonso Mango Red Chili Sauce. Now that's what I'm talking I think, about. I think we've tried something with chili mango before from this I box. Love, yeah, I love mango. 
Let me just put it here and I'll, just, I'll read a little bit about this. That smells like chutney, like you know, like Ooh. um, you know, like the kind of chutney you have with like um, with curries. Mm -hmm. That's okay. exactly, exactly what it smells like. So this one says, this is a fresh and fruity sauce with a medium kick to it. So okay. I think we, we actually started with the strongest one. The mango and fennel flavoring uh, comes through making it ideal for dipping or using on a sarni. What's a sarni? Sarni, it's a sandwich. Oh, okay. Yeah. What do you guys call it? Here we go. Do you call it a sarni, a bat, a sandwich? What do you call it? Let us know in the comments. Is a sarni like an original thing or uh, it's just like a... It's, it's, there's many, many names. Let's not get into that discussion okay. right okay. now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Go. Hmm. Good. Very curry-like. Mmm. Fennel. Mm -hmm. mm. No, nice. Mm. Not spicy at all. Mm -mm. That's really, really I wouldn't nice. say it's medium kick, it's a uh, low kick. <laughs> low kick, definitely. Yeah, but nice. Yeah. Like there's definitely, like out of all the boxes that we've tried, there's been a few, there's like a mm. chili jam that I really, really enjoy. I think that's something else that I will pretty and much the, destroy. And the ketchup you liked, remember? Mm. Someone's ketchup. Sure. Shut mm. up, chop. Yeah, that was amazing. Yeah, mm. we do have like some favorites already, so <laughs> I'll be reordering. Okay, next one. What did so? Did you? Did we? Yeah, you did read it. Yeah. Didn't you? Okay. Oh, by the way, we have a recipe here. They usually include like a recipe, and this time we have beer battered scorpion fish and chips. Hmm. Well, that's something we could try. You eat fish, yeah. Okay. You don't need scorpion. So this here, this is a this is an interesting one. This is a pot of, of spices. So salt and aromatic cell foo, a madly spicy French blend. So um, it basically says in here, a madly spicy French recipe with pink uh, uh, peppercorns, rosemary, coriander and cayenne. Used as a rub for roast chicken, goose and duck. Lovely of baked fish, ha uh, hake or cod and pan fried scallops. Delicious in sal salariac mash, I can't say that. Palm boulangerie, I think that was. With baby turnips and in the cheesy gratin sauce. So it's like a, it sounds like a very universally. Um, yeah, it's sea salt, rosemary, coriander, pink peppercorn, sweet paprika, garlic, thyme, and cayenne. I can make that myself. To be <laughs> with you. Open it so that we can actually at least smell how it. And we'll um... be able to get it open. Okay, guys. So um, basically, I got the jar open, and it looks like this. It's just a pack of, of herbs. Okay, it doesn't really smell like anything. Just like herbs, basically. Yeah. So. So I'm really curious to try that. We're, we're not going to try this because uh, I don't even know how. Well, we've got 20 million <laughs> spice in our spice yeah. cupboard, so that's just an extra to add. Yeah, we can try with potatoes and, uh, or fish or something like that. So yeah. Um, As always, what do you think? I thought um, that was okay. It wasn't too bad. I mean, I do like the two sauces that we have in here, but both of them are nice. Both of them are nice. I, I think I even slightly prefer the spicy one. Really, I, I, I'm not a mass. I, I don't mind spicy food, but I prefer something I can. Con it has like a really nice flavour to it. I mean, uh, it, it does. It has yeah. some kick, but yeah, this one but is very that mild. That is really, really mm -hmm. nice. I will destroy yeah. that. That will be out over everything, and that will be gone within a couple of months. But so. spices, we're going to test them and uh, tell you what we think uh, later on. Yeah, just put it somewhere. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. And uh, as for snack. Uh, yeah, I kind of get why people like it because it's a little bit like that thing I, I hate um, scratching, sports scratching. I don't know how British people can eat it. I don't know, honestly, don't know. Um, uh, but it, it's, it's a little bit like that. So if you like pork scratchings, you probably enjoy this. Um, similar, like. Similar kind of vibe. Yeah, 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 very similar. So yeah. Um, As always, guys, um, go ahead, do check out the rest of our Flame and Licks videos. Like I said, right now, uh, it's kind of Advent calendar season, so we've been heavily focused on, on the Advent calendar kind of side of things. But we do have some fantastic boxes covering things like um, Flame and Licks, hot sauces. We also do Snack Surprise, which is a monthly subscription box focused on snacks from around the and world. And we're going to be back with all box uh, in January. Yeah, so we're planning loads of new stuff for the new year, but please do go and check out the rest of our channel. Mm -hmm. um, as always, please don't forget to subscribe. If you love our videos, give some support. It's always much appreciated. Hit the notification bell and also check out our social media, which is... Instagram and Facebook. But yep. mostly Instagram... Um... And Facebook. <laughs> and Facebook. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay, well, thank you very much for watching and uh, have a great day, and we shall see you soon. Bye. Bye.